climb the nearest tree I long to tell you your lips look kissable Would I be bold to say they're irresistible Although it's forward to mention romance If I don't speak them now I haven't got a chance If I said it all and put my heart on my sleeve Tell me, could you care for me? Hi everyone, Ms. Moody here. Hope everyone's doing well with their remote learning. What a story you're, you have to tell about this time in your childhood. Alrighty, so today we're gonna read a book about dogs and the dog that's behind me right now belongs to my friend Nancy and I've known Nancy since kindergarten. And uh, Nancy and I will sometimes take walks with Scarlett and I like to call it our pack because you know how dogs like packs. Now, the book we're going to read is a little different uh, type of dog. It's dogs that work. And these are dogs that help humans in all different types of ways. I know I really enjoyed this book and I think you will too. I find it fascinating how these dogs can be such a tremendous help to people. Dogs at Work. Dogs at Work, written by Skylar Glenn. Read by Miss Moody. Dogs are hard workers. They help people in many different ways. This is a herding dog. He keeps the sheep together and moves them from place to place. This is a service dog. She guides her person and warns of danger. This is a search and rescue dog. He follows smells and other clues to find lost people. These are sled dogs. They work together to carry heavy loads and run races through the snow. This is a therapy dog. He gently makes people feel better. This is a police dog. She helps keep everyone safe. This is a stunt dog. He does tricks to make us laugh. This is my dog. Her job is to be my best friend. <laughs> 